Hi, I'm Dr. Vainu Vermuri from My Spine in Louisville, Kentucky, and today we're going to talk about SI joint pain. The anatomy of the SI joint is really interesting. It connects our upper body with our lower body through the pelvis. And to stabilize it, the body has ligaments and muscles which cross the joint. This makes sense, right? Because if it's bearing the weight of your body and it's transferring weight from your upper to your lower body, there can be a lot of stress on this joint. So it can degenerate just like any other joint. When I started learning more about the SI joint and what kind of pain it can cause in, in some of the new treatments that we have, that's when I really became interested in um, diagnosing and treating SI joint pain. It's my job as a clinician to take the patient's history, listen to their story, uh, tell me what causes their symptoms. A lot of times they'll present with pain when they lay on that side or when they go up and down stairs. If they take weight off that side, it feels better, but if they put weight on it, it hurts, so standing hurts. And these are clues that maybe the SI joint's involved. Then we'll go further and lay hands on the patient. So there's provocative tests where we move the leg, trying to stress the SI joint. And if that causes pain, that's a clue that maybe this is what's going on. So once we have an exam that's positive for SI joint possibly being the pain generator, we will order diagnostic and hopefully therapeutic SI joint injections. So when patients come back to me and they've tried injections, they've taken NSAIDs, they've done physical therapy, and they're not getting long-term relief, then we start the conversation about surgery to fix their problem. And now that we have a great option for that, it's exciting because they're relieved that there may be long-term relief for their pain. My preferred way to perform the surgery is with the uh, iFuse Torque. The iFuse Torque procedure is really nice because it's outpatient, it takes less than an hour. The incision is small, it's maybe two to three centimeters. It's truly minimally invasive. In my practice, my spine, we pride ourselves on offering patients the latest in uh, innovation. And I really feel like the iFuse Torque device is consistent with that mission. If you're suffering from hip, spine, or pelvic pain, and you're looking for answers, come on into my spine and we'll work with you together to find out a solution for your pain.